ass game spawn me in the middle of the map. Yeah, maybe I really should enable curse mode. Tagged in curse. Dude, this is ridiculous.
Будьте проклят! Like, that's actually cool. It's, it'd be impossible to kill. God's dead. All the blood already.
See if I actually extract if it um crashes for me. Yep. I extracted and the raid is still going on. That's how you know that it's literally just co-op Tarkov with PMCs, AI, AI PMCs, or, or raiders on every map. So, because he's having the same crashing issues that I'm having, doing exactly what I've always been doing, except for I'll do it offline, and obviously not helmet cam, and, uh... And it, 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 it's doing the same shit. It's doing the exact same type of, um, stuff. He had me there. He just, it's an AI. It just feels like someone at BSG said, oh, you know what would make a lot of money? And anytime a company says that, it just, it's a downhill slope from there. Well, actually, no, let me rephrase that. Someone at BSG said, oh, you know what would make a lot of money and is already in the game? Because this shit is literally, quite literally, already in the game. Oh, fuck. Like, give me progression? Doing exactly this right here. That's all we need. That, that, that's all we need to make that game mode. Like this plus, like, progression for the thing. Also, I think my gun is, uh, not changing stats, because technically I'm already out of the raid. Wonder, do I take damage? Oh, yeah, I do take damage. No, I don't want to die. I want to see this. Like, I actually don't want to die. I just want to see what this bug does, actually. Like, I wonder if my gun will jam or not. Like, fix that shit. This right here. Fix this. Jesus Christ. And your, your, your player base would be...
Look, their suppressors are getting hot as fuck too. Look at that shit, bro. Hot as fuck. Vale, vale, cuisosa. None of these issues uh, happened beforehand. None of them happened. Um, none of these bugs happened before this update. So that tells me they literally just they made offline forward mode with with uh, PMC bots and progression. That's all they did, and that's literally just connecting the dots of shit that's already in the game. That this is like the most aggravating. The, the, the scabs have stopped spawning already. Or they can't shoot anymore because their guns have all heated up and now it's only gonna be new scabs that come in. Is there even a raid timer? There's no raid timer. I have no raid timer. There's, a, there's actually just no raid timer. I can just be in this shit for however long I want to be in it. Nice. That's that's nice. Other than that, I think it's pretty cool. Well, bodies everywhere. Game's bugged, I can't leave. That's nice. Didn't die? Oh, he died. Oh, that sniper's dead. Nah, this is actually pretty cool, knowing that guns can only be used for, like... BITCH! Ah! And it's already heated up, it's only got like three rounds in it. Yeah, that first one got him good, or the second one, I don't know which, but... I'm 
don't have any ammo for it. Oh, he's having to do it too. He's jamming and shit. Bro, I gotta get a pistol. Thank God. Oh, he was jamming a hunter. Oh, fuck. I was hoping it was like an AK or something. Something I can at least shoot two times before I have to, like, get a new one. Oh, that's not... That's not it. Okay, I'll, I'll take the AM-70 versus that. Oh, with slugs? Oh, no. Uh, okay. Fucking slugs again? Oh, my God. I mean, okay, the mayo, the mayo's worth it, all right? Mayo's. Slugs it is, alright. Sniper scabs standing up there, dude. I can't. Alright, we're going to dorms. Dude. I need food and shit. I'm actually, wait. Oh yeah, I need food. Like, oh, I have food and water. I can easily see how long I can survive. I have made Truck Up into a survival game. Oh, this is nice. I have all the stashes. I have. Like, all the loot that's here. The guns are all fucking shit. It's now a survival game. I am I am here to survive. There's bodies everywhere. Oh, a fucking pistol. Ah, oh, I was looking for one. Yes, thank you. Thank God, I found a pistol. Like, now, the only thing that matters to me is status effect changers. And, um, and food and water. I care about my life again. That's crazy. We're gonna look in here for crackers and shit. Let's do that. Tarkov is now a survival game, bro. I have done it. It's amazing. What did I say? Crackers and I found croutons. Woo! That's amazing. Damn, I'm happy. I'm actually happy, right? I just don't have a, a, a stash for... To return to. Uh, 
I can take my time now. That's crazy. I don't have to worry about shit. But, uh, hold on. Give me a second. Yeah, yeah, I can take my time now. I'm good. I'm going to keep these mags just because I might find some, like, U.S. or something. Oh. Okay. I wonder if there's anything that I can do to fix that. Can I, like, take the suppressor off and... The muzzle is still. I think it's the integral of the gun. Damn, so individual parts don't heat up? Crazy. I search. I don't need to search these. I need to search these like guys' pockets and shit. Steel plates that are good, that type of shit. You know. I feel better, but who knows? Who mo? Who knows? I might take a. I might take a, a fucking shot. You know, like that's a good. That's a good replacement plate. Like. long I can actually stay in this raid. Dude, there, there's like everything that matters to me now is, is completely different. Like. Wow. Wow. I wonder if you can do this and, and pull up. Oops. Really didn't mean to do that. John Mosin? If I could aim? If I could aim? I don't, I really don't want to change it. I don't want to change, like, the ability to aim or not. It should definitely, like, be hard to, um... Do that shit and then like think about it like not being able to aim you know left left shoulder only uh and then on on top of that um guns like irreversibly each shot go get hotter and hotter so i might be able i might be able to like build a fucking a meta thing for this mode right here this uh survive tarkov survival mode I might be able to build, like, a, a really low-maintenance gun or something that lasts, like, as long as possible. It'd probably end up being, like, a semi-automatic, uh, like, some something. Why am I searching those? Those, those literally do not matter to me. I need fucking food. Shit. That's, that's what matters. And even then, not a lot. I need water right now. I have Aquamari, dude. Easy. Got me the rest of the way up. At Aquamari, bro. Holy fuck. That's a whole nother raid. It's worth of time. Just 
bodies everywhere, dude. Holy shit. Oh, what the fuck is that? Attention, perception, strength, stamina recovery. Interesting. Okay. Oh my god. Paul. Okay, cool. It's not okay. Oh no, I should not. I need a I need everything that that reduces heat. Yeah, plus 14 heat. I I'm good. But that's a... Oh my god, that's like... That's like an amazing find. Like, actually no shit. It doesn't have the laser, but... That's... I... Damn. There's an opportunity to build a silenced Mosin in this raid right now. Oh my god. I'll, I'll keep that, just in case I find a weird ass gun that needs it. I can, like, sit on the roof of dorms and, and enjoy myself right now, actually. Like, that's... That's cool. No raid timer. No, none. Nil. Around this corner. Get, get doinked in the head and never repeat this again. Never get the same glitch. I would genuinely, honestly, like, get the kit that I would run in this, and then, like, probably be, like, on here for, like, 12 hours. Just, like, like, committing to memory. Like, this is how I would want to, my offlines to be, like, an unlimited time limit. Just, I can, like, I need a cool spot to chill. The crazy thing is, too, is that I know there's scavs out there still. So that's... That's good. That's cool. If, bro, if I didn't have scav war on... That would be insane. There would be, like, too many scav. I probably would have died already. I am gonna enjoy me a cigar, though, so...
I turned Tarkov into a survival game, bruh. It's literally a survival game. It's like, how long can I actually stay in this shit? I can't. There's no raid timer. I can't even, like, see what my extracts would be. This is what happens whenever Nikita, by design, can't even server test this shit on the, on the server test. And since they're fucking with the base game, it, uh... I kill flies right now. I'm, I'm gonna time lapse this later. The no tape raid timer type beat. Just uh, able to stay in the game for as long as I want to. This will be this part will be a time lapse. That's really really cool. And my voice will be like. <laughs> Thank you. 
crazy. Knocking him out of the air, dude. Probably just like inducing a seizure or whatever, but like... That's still as traumatizing as I want their life to be. That's nice. All I hear is a I'm getting hit. Again, my voice. And then you hear. And then you hear. From that. And then from that. Oh my god. Imagine what you'd hear from that. Probably oh, just a. <laughs> just imagine that too. Ow! Hit myself. Ain't no fly. Hey, fly. Chew. Get the fuck out of here, son of a bitch. No whistling. Bad. You know what? I'm fine with that. You leave the room. No, you're still in here? Alright, you're dying then.
Yes, fucking. Stupid ass, goddamn, motherfucking, goddamn. You know what I mean? She. All right, I'm back. Ah, go have not smoke my cigar. Yeah, who dat? Who dat? Who wondered? I was fighting the flies, man. I live in Texas, where the flies just run rampant. Y'all motherfuckers that live in cold climates got it fucking lucky, bro. Stay inside and you never see a fucking fly unless you're just nasty about yourself. Like, can you imagine just never seeing a fucking fly? That shit would be awesome. But no, these flies gotta fucking land on everything and shit. Fucking ruin shit. And... Like, oh, you have a nice screen? Good luck fucking keeping that shit where you've... Black dots, that's just dried fly shit. Yeah. Oh my god. Holy shit.
that's big. Like, oh, wow. That's also big. Although not extremely. All they need is this, but consistent and online. That's a whole nother plate carrier, brother. Build a kit, slowly build a kit. Splash drive.
water. I didn't even check water room. I need water and I didn't even check water room. Oh, I'm just heavy. Damn, I need to stash some shit. Okay. Oh. Old gas stash. Uh, none of them are here. All right, in the old gas, then I guess.
He had it. Still thirty kilos. So their AI turns off. I was literally standing right in front of their face for a minute. Their, a uh, their AI turns off. It's not really that much fun no more. It's not that much fun if their AI just turns off. Other than seeing how long I can survive off of random food I find.
actually like get my stats back up. Grounded up and running? Yeah, yeah, I have it downloaded, but, um, so, uh, this is the same raid that, uh, well, the, I, I'm, I'm in offline, alright, but this, I haven't, like, I went to extract just cause, like, I was like, oh, dying, like, fucks my shit up to where I have to alt F4 out of the game and all that. So, like, uh, so I was like, okay, I'll just extract and see what it does. It finished the timer for the extract, and then, um, yeah, I don't have a timer no more. So, I'm just seeing how long I can go. Um, until, like, I starve. Because, unfortunately, the AI for the scabs turned it off. Like, for a while they were still there. I think, like, maybe for the duration of, like, the max length the scav raid can go for afterwards. So I think I figured out how that back end kind of works. So I think PMC is literally, like, the last five minutes of the raid, like, they literally cannot be in the raid at all. Because of the what, what I saw. At least when it came to the AI. Or maybe it was just, like, the... the the scavs that had spawned in up to that point had their AI functioning, and then the ones that spawn in afterwards, like, they don't, and then now the scavs are just, like, not spawning at all. Yeah, I know I'm looting right now, so it's not as immersive, but earlier, dude, I was able to, like... It's it's gone from morning time all the way to night right now. This is pretty cool. And, uh, I think it's it's just leftover, um... Uh... Shit that's, uh... From... Them making that other game, basically. Uh, it's about to get really dark, so let me, like... Find an inside area that's lit up. But I, I have something cool. I could run over to dorms and show you, actually. But the uh, the guns. Hold on, let me. This will be easier to show you. Yeah. I am gonna hate wasting the ammo, but I don't need it. Honestly, I'll be, I'll be all right. I'll take the U.S. Uh, all right. So I could do it right here, actually. Wrong one. I found this one in a box. This will become relevant later, but I had to toss my gun. I had an AK, but and I found I found that one in a box. So Do you see how it looks like a helmet cam though? Like like could you just imagine like tactically This is me leaning to the left. And if I wanted to, I can I could fix it. I could fix it. There you go. It's fixed. I'm leaning a little bit to the right now. Um, and then, but I can't jog. If I jog, it resets. But it looks like a helmet cam now, 100% because of that. The way the good the gun is positioned. It's probably really dark right now. Let me get in some light. But it looks like a. I found out where the light source is. It's just hovering in the air right here. It's just like right here in the air. Yeah, it's like... Yes. Alright, that scared me. Uh, the, the AI um, is still working. 
Or maybe that one was just bugged. It was probably just one that was, but he could have totally racked my shit. I was. Oh, but you see the barrel? The barrel is not cooling down. Also, just. Me sitting on the couch POV to the TV and then like static in the TV and like kind of flip. Oh hell yeah, that that's definitely like pretty good. But yeah, I could definitely probably swing that too. Um, so yeah, it's just not cooling down. I tried tossing it on the ground, whatnot, but this gun is now permanently fucked even if it was brand new that it would be heated up too much to you you could shoot it once and then it will fail to cycle because it's heated up all the way so i found this ak that's not touched at all e expecting that the the scabs would continue spawning like they were yeah the, the barrels you should have seen the suppressor i had it was literally like red hot and I was sitting there bang and then I would hide and then fix the jam and then I'd come back out and bang and then I'd go and hide and fix the jam and come back out. But uh, another thing too is uh, like since I'm doing the helmet cam thing, I'm not aiming down sights. Right there, that was just instinctual because I didn't even register the footstep. And I barely registered him saying shit. And like, uh, but me turning around and shooting at him was like an, a natural response. It wasn't me trying to, like, ha like maybe 20% of it was me like trying to kill the scav. It was, otherwise it was just me instinctually like snap toing. The suppressor gotta be a puddle. Yeah, it was. Oh, it's bright as fuck. It is nighttime right now. Can I go through an entire fucking night cycle in Tarkov? That's like actually insane if this happens. Why am I searching this? That's not even... I can't... I'm looking for like apple juice and shit. And the thing too is I don't know if this is at all repeatable. I'm pretty sure they don't want it to be if it if it is because this is definitely uh, a, the result of them making that thing because I have never ran into this bug before and I religiously play offline to aim train and situational awareness train and, and, and just positioning train and stuff like that. Albeit all against AI, but they can't extract or anything. Like, even though I knew that no way in the world would there be anything down there, I still mock peek it. Just, like... Like, not that wasn't a, at all a correct peek for that. But I mock peeked it just because, like, okay, muscle memory. Mock peek. I'm not gonna not peek it because I know there's nothing down there. I'm still gonna peek it even though I'm in an offline raid and stuff like that. Just, like... So if in ever I am just idly like, oh, do do do, going to extract, I'm still gonna at least, all right, yeah, there's nothing there, and then run in. Like, it's called muscle memory for a reason. It's shit you fucking are ingrained with so hard that it, um, it comes natural to you. I haven't been up, oh, I haven't done that quest. I will be, I'm going to Old Gas right now because that's the only part of the map I haven't been to after the bug. Uh, besides Big Red, but I don't really care about Big Red. Because there's going to be like four scabs at most. 
go to aim labs for aim training. Well, the thing is, is that, like, I don't know if aim labs will directly correlate the skill. Like, maybe, like, the snap to, but, like, in, in all intents and purposes, is like, if you play keyboard and mouse for the majority of your life, you're going to have the snap to down. Like... Like the, the, oh shit, there's someone right there. And the, you're gonna have that. Now, aim training in Tarkov is a lot different now because, like, the way recoil works. It's like, uh, like, it locks your hands into shit. Because your, your hands are dealing with recoil. So, like, if I took this gun and, and shot as fast as I could while aiming and stuff, the recoil, while it's affecting my hands, will lock my hands in that position, and then and then it, it, it continues down it's because your your PMC is dealing with the recoil of shooting the gun. So it's like I don't know. It's like what what's worth it? I mean, I get the I get aim labs. I've never done it. I've never. At all, I've literally these could be these builds are cool. The fucking it doesn't even come with a wood grip from the trader or any or any way you get it naturally, other than this mode right here. A hundred percent why you're gonna use but yeah hell yeah. They have different versions of like track tracking snaps and different levels of stuff. You get super in depth. You can find user made stuff. This is comparable. Look and tracking down, and then use offline for specific track. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just do horde, high, or high or horde and hard mode, depending on what level of kit I want to train for. And then, um,. It might just be this flashlight, but like, there's like, fog at night or something. I'm looking at the point aiming. Different for... So that that swing around the corner is a lot different for left hand than right. Because right, you're just it drags away. Left, you're it, you're stabbing the gun actually. Good. I haven't seen a single stash either, so I think that's part of the bug. Because I have a stash. I have a pilgrim that I have shit in it. I recommend analyze. It improves greatly, and then. With your already big knowledge on how the aim and target works, you can aim better for sure. Hell yeah. I should probably, yeah, I'd probably check it out. I have a 60 round drum mag for that. Yo, a stash. I'm on M4. Ah. Oh. Yo, food? I'm that not bad actually. Thank you for that spawn. Though I need water. Water is way more rare than food in this game, dude. Let me snooze this ad just because. Not let me get this ad. Can't hear me talk directly.
Now, that just makes me want to get a secondary that can't jam or something. Alright, it'll probably just failure to fire or some bullshit. Now, this is what I was coming for. Huh? Okay, okay. These work the same that stashes do then. They're not loaded in to begin with. Just find water everywhere? Well, dude, I'm like, <clears throat> I'm, well, I have this ice green, but that's, I found that off of a scab. So yeah, scabs will have snacks and drinks and stuff, so drinks on them. But like, when it comes to like loot in the ground or I can't, I hate that I can't loot the, the ration crates. That's. Kind of annoying. I'm about to go to med med case. Med building crack house. I I didn't loot this actually. I might find something in here. Pineapple juice? No. That'll hold me over for a while actually. Six two. That's a that's a small bag of good shit right there. To be honest, it's been two years. Oh yeah. Oh um. Well yeah, it's been two years. You don't even know. Uh. Um. It's not all there anymore. Like you know how like stash runs used to be like. You spawn in and you. This stash, this stash, this stash, even as a scab, you just run all the stashes. That's not really, you can't really reliably do that no more. And, uh, like, the gun crates in dorms, and the ones in the kitchen in big dorms, and, um, the loot in here, uh, the, uh, it's more so just, like, if this box is... Like, is this loot that spawns here, here? No, it's not here at all. And I'm in an offline. Usually offlines guarantee the loot spawns so you can learn them. But they uh, they made it to where it's very, like, hit or miss. It's random. Like, randomized loot or whatever. It's not really, like, random as in the amount of stuff that's on the map. Like, it's not fluctuative. It, the same amount of shit's on the map. It's just, like, random. Like, there's no loot right here. Um, random. Oh, wait, there is something. But, you know, like, used to, you'd have, like, one, two, three, and then, like, something here. And it, it, it was, okay, what spawned there this raid? But, like, these spawned in. Those didn't. So it's a lot more, uh... Yeah. God damn! Oh my god! Can I get this lucky on a real raid? That ammo is like... Yeah, it is a good thing. Cause like, um... Mm. What's it called? Just the... Way of moving around the map is gone now. For a lot of players. Like, going directly A, B, A, B, A, B. Like. Or, like, the... Oh, it didn't spawn, and then immediately, like... Fucking off. Like, now... Like, in water building, you know how, like, there's a whole bunch of different gun crates? 
any one of them could spawn, all of them could spawn in, or none of them could spawn in. Or, like, a number of them can spawn in. It's just random. But I, generally, I find that it's about the same amount of loot you're able to come out of in raid with. So that means that the, the average raid, it's probably the same amount of loot. It's just dispersed differently every single raid. So, that's, it's really nice, actually. It was weird to begin with, because you had to, like, kind of adjust. But... It makes people actually look for loot now. Because before, people would only loot containers, and then the scabs would come by and be like, all right, what'd they drop on the ground? What's on the shelves? Because they didn't even look at what's on the shelves. Besides, maybe in here. I'm in the worst room to be saying that sentence, but... Um... You get what I mean, like... It's, uh, it's not so, uh actual inventory based anymore people are way more likely to like come over here and look at these and come over here look at this tray and maybe the top you know come over here look at the this shelf right here that right here this right here that right there oh, i think any shelf in this room can spawn meds to be honest. i haven't found anything right here actually that's cap so but i think every other shelf besides maybe this one like, these open areas is what I'm talking Like, right there, right there, right here. Like, I'm pretty sure any one of them can spawn loose loot on the top of them. And then, like, up here, on here, on the shelves, up here and shit. But you see, like, I'm scanning through this shit and, like, where's the loot? Like, I'm not even actually looting, I'm just being like, yeah, like, these spots right here, like, people are way more in tune with that shit now. But, yeah. Oh, and scabs will run up and loot bo people's bodies, like, sometimes blatantly, so it's kind of weird, but, um... Like, if, if your buddy dies, it's there's an actual good chance that if that body is left untouched in an area that's AI scabs traverse then um, they're more than likely going to pick up their gun. I think. I kind of just want to watch the uh, sunrise a little bit. By the way, not a bad spot. Oh, right, wait, I'll leave, uh... I don't think you can... No. I thought it would be a bigger backpack. Maybe a pilgrim or something would be a good example of a single body with no bag on it. It makes it way more interesting, yeah. Yes, a lot more fights because people were like, alright, fuck, I gotta go see if this spawned in. Oh, shit. Oh, my webcam's not on. Let me know whenever you're out on the end. I have a thing, but it doesn't. Huh? 
Love you too. No. Huh? All right, it says the ads are over, but I'm not 100% sure of that. Um, uh, Yes, there's a lot more fights introduced. Because uh, people are like, oh, fuck, I need... Like, I need to go check and see if this shit spawned in, like, this raid. And so, like, that happens a lot more. Hell yeah. Like, there's a lot more fights, definitely. Because, like, people are like, oh, fuck, I need to go find... I need to go see if this area spawned in with its loot. Like, Dorms is, is a little bit more poppy. Because people stick around longer when there is loot. Because they want to loot the entire thing. Every location, though, is across the board. Every map. Just like, if there's good loot there and it spawns in, then boom. Um, random question. Stream mic is, yes, my headset. Headset, definitely my headset. Um, okay. Well, the scav looting bodies paired with how scavs will run behind cover and shit. And, um, and like, just... They'll, they'll actually sneak up to a firefight that had happened to see if there's anyone still there and stuff like that. And then they'll loot bodies and shit like that. So they'll, they'll silently and come up and boom, they just got a meta M4. Fucking shoot you with their taws anyways. It, it doesn't matter. Like, they just pick up the gun. It's for insurance reasons. If a, if an AI scav picks up your gun, then um, it's, it's, it's counted as looted. Unless the scav dies. And he's not looted. Yeah, I saw the mic question. Yeah, it is my... Key room still big? Um, not so as much. Because two reasons. Um, vaulting. So you know how you could jump into USEC building? Uh, break the gla glass first and jump into USEC building? You can just vault into that motherfucker. I don't even think you need to break the glass. I think you just vault through the glass and break it like that. I'm... You might still have to break it, but you can, like, literally from the outside just vault in, vault out. It's a way more of a dangerous, like, way to loot that room, but you don't need a key for it no more. And you can loot it as a scav. So if you scav customs, that room is a definite check. But I have personally felt that um, key rooms are more likely to have their loot in them, but they're not definitely guaranteed it said two reasons i don't remember what the other reason was i think that was the other reason actually don't mind it's like the keys still yes do matter i mean some keys that never mattered in the first place but now they do And do you hear the ambience? Oh, hell yeah. But they added way more background noise. To tar like, it's going to sound like a completely different game whenever you get in. Like, you will have schizophrenic moments of, like, the metal creaking around you. And like, huh? huh? Someone just aim? What? Oh no, it was just the giant crane right in, in, on top of me that moved in the wind or some shit. But yeah, I'm gonna, um. I'll still be talking and shit, but I'll hop on grounded after this sun. 
makes it bright. At least I can enjoy a, a full night in Tarkov. That's like, what, like, that's, that doesn't happen. Just staying up all night. St I started early in the morning, enjoyed the normal, I'm talking about in the game. Uh, I, I it had a normal, like, offline, uh, horde and, and, and scab ward customs match. Well, with the head cam and the laser using using it sounds way more intense than it used to be. Yeah, it is a lot more like unless you have the drop on the scav, you're fighting scavs now. It's not and 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 the the old thing of like, all right, I killed the scav and then just loot his body real quick. I I'd, <laughs> I'd highly recommend you don't. You're going to lose track of the first three scavs you kill by the time you feel capable of leaving the area. Like, choosing to fight scavs is a choice. Like, it's it's like, all right, like, I'm in an area, I didn't hear any other gunshots nearby, which is a plus and a minus, because if you stay in the area where you just shot your gun for long enough, there will be the brave scavs that come forward, and then there will be the non-so-brave scavs that stay in cover. And then there'll be the motherfuckers that are just coming around the corners, bro. Like, they just be coming around the corners, bro. But yeah, it is a lot more. This is what Tarkov should feel like feeling in Tarkov. So it's nice. Guns are real. Scavs actually care about their lives and take cover and peek like human beings would. Like, they don't go and do crazy fucking shit, but they, like, they lean, they slow lean, they fucking crouch lean, they do the jutting shit where you're, like, you're, you're, like, power leaning into your crouch, that quick, like, stance, step out thing, they do that. They, they, like, they actually, like, fully utilize what could, should have been there in their coding now, so that's nice. And, and they, they, they burst fire a lot better because of recoil, and then also just their shooting patterns are different. You definitely still tell that they're a, it's an AI shooting across the map, other, uh, other than, like, a, a few guns or, like, a few different ways the AIs can be shooting at something. Like, if it goes behind cover, they mid-stop their full auto or something like that. They don't, like, heavy full auto you, but they would shoot, like, a a normal civilian would shoot a full auto gun. The... The... Like, unless you're, like, you went to the range for the last year, I don't feel like... Like, I, de I definitely wouldn't be able to take a full 30-round clip to my shoulder. Like, that, I'd probably hurt after the first five, six, seven rounds. I mean, depending on the caliber, but, like, let's say I'm shooting 7.62, like, AK, you know, by 39. Like, that, that it's, it, it's not, like, the biggest bullet, but <laughs> it's a pretty goddamn big bullet, and it kicks, so, like... Um, I have shot a 5.45. That's why I didn't say that caliber. I have shot a full auto 5.45 on a stand or, uh, with one of those uh, horizontal grips. My uncle, he's the ex-DEA, um, retired, um, and he smokes a lot of fucking weed. <laughs> he just, he's like, he, he was, uh, he, he's the, he was in it, kind of ex-DEA. Like, he's got tenure. And no one knows where he lives off grid. He he knows some shit, and he doesn't doesn't like talking. Hmm. <laughs> Let me leave me alone. Um, oh, I'm not even in fucking, I'm supposed to be in here enjoying a cigar with the, 
Tarkov. Sunrise. Yeah, is it fucking gonna rain? Where's the sun? Was that the sunset? Don't tell me that was the sun that set. What direction am I looking right now? That's north. Sunsets in the west, doesn't it? Does the sun set in the west? She doesn't know. Or I didn't hear her answer. God damn it. Still here. Uh, okay. You support the Dean? No, no, he's retired. He's full retired. Like, he, he's clocked out retired. Like, he has no contacts, nothing. Like, he retired, and then, like, I think, like, five years later, he went off grid. And, like, he kept, like, the shit that mattered to him. He kept his Harley. He kept a couple of his guns. Like, he, I think, I don't know what era he was in the DEA, but I think, I'm pretty sure it was, like, the 70s, like, 80s kind of era. So, like, everything then for him was, like, a lot different than it is now for shit. But, um, it, it was definitely still, like, during the paper era, though. Like, where shit written on paper and then, like, loss of information type shit. Like, he... he there's, there's a lot I can't get into, kind of, because I'm streaming, but, um, essentially, I'm not even supposed to be, like, yeah, he's off-grid somewhere. Like, if they knew that, if they knew that he was related to me and my uncle and, like, whatnot, and they knew, like, I was saying shit about it, they would probably, like, find him or whatever. And say there's a reason he went off grid. So that's that's it. That's all. That's but uh yeah. Motherfucker cool dude. Like legitimately cool motherfucker. He just didn't you know, like some things. So didn't like the DA in ways. The reason why he uh quote unquote retired. It's not real. I can't jump over that. I can't walk on this. Oh, it is real. No, it's not real. It's not real. Damn it. Oh, they... Oh, they... I should probably, like, uh, I thought that was the sunset. I, I no longer think it is. I think we just dealt with, like, the dust. But this is the extract I came to. That here, it extracted, and then... Damn. This right here is always fun to do. Oh, not that.
just want to see what it looks like from the bridge, and then I'm gonna hop on something else. Damn, I didn't even smoke my cigar yet. Jesus fucking Christ. Yo, that's the moon! That has got to be the moon. That's where the moon is. Okay. I'm not so mad anymore. It's just... Good. All right, cool. I was literally about to say, damn, I've been in this raid for like... What the fuck was that noise? It wasn't that. I wish I had a scope. Oh, it's a fucking owl. Dude, you can't see him. You'd see him through a scope, though. Oh my, I don't... Did I almost Superman off the... Let me, um... Oh, you said earlier the camping spot on the train. That is a pretty good place. You definitely have to have the drop on people and make sure this side of the map is uh, clear of people. Shit off my fucking. I'll keep a nade and that's it. I should have kept that stanima drug. I found a stanima drug and I was like, uh, it takes energy away and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find food or not. So I stashed it. I found a pilgrim and I put that all, um. in the. There's a van at Old Gas that has the back open. Damn, you really get just can't see that shit. That's like kind of annoying, actually. About the. Unless I'm retarded. Did I go too far? No. I did. Yeah. It's right there. Oh, you can, okay. Yeah, through a scope, you could definitely, like, set the lights up there, and then, like, because they won't be able to see the extract, they'll turn their night vision off. 